when I was younger, I saw something terrible happen. I was only a kid, and I wasn't supposed to be there to begin with. I guess I thought that I'd get into trouble or whatever, but I never told anyone until now. My father took me fishing at this lake for as long as I can remember. I loved going there. It had walking trails and a summer camp near its shores and an abundance of wildlife. But Dad told me that the park closes at night, like it does all winter long. I figured they just close it down just like every other place that I know of, for typical state law reasons or whatever. But Dad told me it wasn't because of that at all. Instead, Dad said it was because the place was different after dark, tainted when enshadowed. He would tell me grand old stories about the natives in the area, and the Englishmen that pushed them out, and why the area remains a remote wilderness to this day, aside from a few scattered households. I never really believed him, until I saw those two men drown while walking the camp late on a winter evening. I don't know what exactly they were doing out on the ice, but I do know that they worked there. Everyone said they drown. Still do. But I know the truth. I saw the thing that reached up through the ice and pulled them under it. And I saw what remained of the one who came back, the way the animals reacted, and the way that the trees came to life. I never wanted to believe it, and I tried to tell myself that what I saw couldn't be real. Eventually, I moved away. But now that I'm older and I've inherited my father's house, I've moved back, and I've heard about all the things that have been happening here. And though I can't explain why it's come back, why now? I'm pretty sure I've got a good idea on how this thing all started in the first place. Social media can be very unpredictable, especially regarding horror content. If this content gets removed, all new content will be simultaneously presented on various websites provided in the description to this video. Make sure to follow me in other digital spaces so that you never miss out on the terror. Also, if you like this video, make sure to leave a comment and hit the like button. It helps the channel a lot. If you're new to the channel and you enjoy what's here, consider hitting that subscribe button and the notification bell so that you never miss an upload. Writing is a dream of mine, and it's all of you that make that dream come true.